Welcome to Lunar Flight Tutorial 3, Navigation and Heading Alignment. Lunar Flight features several systems to help you navigate and fly in the correct direction, depending on your current mission objective. The Nav Info display indicates the currently selected navigation point and provides buttons to cycle through each available nav point. You change the selected navigation point by clicking on the Nav Info display buttons, cycling with the B button on the Xbox 360 controller, left clicking and right clicking on the cockpit switch or using the assigned keyboard inputs. When accepting a mission a button is provided to automatically select the appropriate mission objective nav point. During survey missions and time trials the navigation system will automatically select the next appropriate navigation point for you. To help align with the selected navigation point there are several heading display indicators the orientation spheres, both in the top-down camera and the HUD, provide indicate directions to the selected navigation point. In addition, there's the primary heading display down here, which indicates the relative direction to the selected navigation point, as well as a north marker. In addition, the map also provides your current heading direction relative to the map. An additional function of the primary heading display is to provide landing alignment. It automatically activates when landing at the selected navigation point. You can see it's activated now. And that concludes this lesson.